Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Luca Plays. If it's your first time here, double welcome to you. Today, we are going to be taking a look at Minoria, a game that I have... I feel like I've been waiting for, for literally years. Ever since I played, um... Momodora Reverie Under the Moonlight, which is a super fucking good game. If you have not played it, go play it right now. Cause that's a real good game. It's another. It's it's uh it's like a Metroidvania kind of Souls like, and it has very nice art and very nice music, and it is very nice to play. And I like that game a lot. This one looks to be similar. Uh, it's a spiritual successor, so it's not a direct sequel to Momodora. I think Momodora Reverie Under the Moonlight is Momodora Four. Let me double check that. Is that is that what the case is? Momodora fingers, can you cooperate with me? Yes, that is Momodora Four. There's I I should probably play through the other three games, but I haven't even. I think I looked at the, at the first one and I was like, oh, it's not the kind of game that I I would expect to cut to for, for Momodora Reverie Under the Moonlight to come from. But uh, I should uh, maybe I'll give this a look at some point. Which corpses? This our prota oh look at our fucking protagonist. The other sister, the other sister shouldn't be too far ahead. Let's keep going in this direction. Oh, it's also it's 3D, which is uh unfamiliar because Momodora is a nice uh, 2D pixel art. Sister Samilla, this area is infested with witches. It is our duty to pur to purify them at all costs. I'm only a novice, but. I hope to provide sufficient assistance to you. I can't read. Their ceremony has already begun. We do not have much time. Let's proceed to search in search of the princess. God, it's it's really late. I'm recording this like oh wait. I'm recording this like pretty much right immediately after the game has uh, come out. I, I I like took a short nap. Uh, and was like and then woke up and it was and it was 1 a.m. and the game had come out and I was like oh right video games. I need, I need to play a video game. I I didn't expect this to be our... Whoa. Okay. This is our protagonist, I guess. It feels uh, a good bit clunkier than Reverie Under the Moonlight, I will say. Um... Yeah, it's... I don't... Hmm... It's hard for me to put my finger on it, but it, it doesn't feel like it's, uh... A animated as nicely? Is there a dodge roll? Yes. Maybe I'm crazy. Wow, that took half my fucking health. Mmm, maybe I am crazy. I mean, it definitely... Seems a little bit... Clonk. Slightly. Ever so slightly clonk. But not horrifically. How do I use... There we go. What's that? Whoa! That's what that does. Okay. There's... There's... Oh, we found a circuit! What's that? Give me that. Silver coin. Uh, those are probably traded in for, for stuff later on. You don't have a double jump. I suspect that we will probably get a double jump later. Okay, these guys are, are super duper easy to kill. We're getting experience for kills too, which is not something that happened in uh, the first one. Whoa! They throw a bomb. They're not very nice. They are not very nice at all. Starting with five heals is also... Is it new? Did we start Reverie Under the Moonlight with five heals? I can't remember. This looks like a safe area, Sister Samilla. Perhaps we can rest here for a bit? Uh, what's wrong? I'm sorry, it's just... To tell you the truth, I'm very scared. It is my first time in a mission like this. I trust your combat abilities, though, Sister Samilla. Please do not misunderstand. I'm sure we will do well. I have faith in us. Oh! You're very nice. I like you. Ink bottles. Not a bonfire! Uh, it was, I think it was a bell. In Reverie Under the Moonlight. Not 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 so not so direct a parallel this time. 
Which is probably for the best. Uh, lest people say, oh, it's just kind of, you know, trying to be a Souls like. Oh. Sister Fran is very cute, I will say. Sister Fran, you got it going on. Yeah, you have, you have, an, there was a sound. Oh. You're going well, you're doing well so far. Please don't let your guard down, Sister Smilla. I will not. I am very good and strong. That's the same sound effect from, from the last game. Whoa! Ow! Wow, people do a lot of damage, though. A lot of damage. Big hits. Wait. Oh, whoa. We got a parry. That's super neat. Whoa, hello. Big bounce. Oh, that's not the button I wanted. That one needs a key. All right, let's keep going. Ooh. Ooh, no. This looks like a bad room. There's some dead folks. Why is there dead folks in here? Is there a big bad... Yeah, probably. I feel like there's a big bad enemy in here. This is a... Hello? Oh, she got the big titty. Like a big titty anime lady. Look at that. What the hell? Uh, uh hi. Look at that sword. That's a cool sword. Going to like a rat, princess. Now, if you cooperate and return to your cell. Uh, silence, witch. You disgrace these grounds by wearing the attire of the order. Oh, ow, rude. This is not the, the time for your religious fantasies, your highness. Are we going to interfere? Hi, hello. Huh? I didn't expect to find more nuns around here. I thought I got rid of every one of you. Are you here to rescue your majesty? This is what she is now. Look at her. Your kind wouldn't even consider her human at this point. Point your crosses at her and burn her alive. Pass your sacred judgment. I'm waiting, children of God. Liz, the ceremony is not yet complete. I trust you can handle those two? Leave it to me. That's a, also a really cool character design. Hi. I'm gonna give you a couple... Oh! Wow! That's a heckin' attack! That's a big ol' honker of an attack! Whoa! Hey! That's not... It... This feels like a fight that I could... Oh, I could lose. And not all, and like I just get a different like variation on the story. Cause look at how much f fucking health she has. Oh, I mean we're doing good. My uh, oh, what the fuck? Look at all the hits we're doing. I'm not, I, I don't think I'm too terrible at, uh, like, you know, like, the 2D Souls-like kind of genre that has emerged. Okay, well, maybe, maybe that's not quite accurate because I'm still almost dead. I mean, we're almost there. We almost got it. Nope! That's a death. Okay, that was still that was still not an incredibly difficult fight. Let's let's give that another uh, a second shot. Cause that was still that that was very clearly doable. Rather than the the uh, whenever I get to it to a boss that's even like vaguely difficult, I always suspect that they're um they're a boss that you're supposed to die on, which is probably not not the most constructive way. To view any boss. Look at that little slit in this lady's dress. She ain't no nun. That's... That's overtly sexy. <laughs> can we skip this cutscene? We just Can we just like... Yeah, cool. Just let me do the fight again. Let me do this. Let me give her a good couple wax. Over 40 wax. I wonder... No. Okay, let's try... Doing a parry didn't seem to do anything. Doing dodges seems just as efficient. In fact, it lets me get behind her, so probably more. 
Then again, we should maybe test out a parry. Okay, so this... While initially threatening, fully understandable. What is... Wait. Okay, so parrying a boss enemy doesn't seem like it will, like, do what a, I what you expect a parry to do. Because that... She just, like, she just went right through that. Ah, what? Come on. That's some sloppy hitbox shenanigans. Hey, you're dead. I fucked you up. Are you gonna join my party now? Nope! You just blew, you just blew up. Bye! Whoa. I like that. That's very stylish. And very satisfying. Also, we got a level up. Are we gonna, are we gonna talk to the big titty princess? Let's 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 have uh let's have a little chat with the with the big titty princess. Hello. Are you hurt, Princess Amelia? Not much, sister. I appreciate your help. She has horns. Those are definitely not part of her headdress. Also, her eyes are... Oh, she's really pretty, though. I assume you are under the sacred office's orders. Members of the Inquisition? Yes, Your Majesty. I am Sister Anna Fran. Anna Fran! That's a good name. And this is Sister Samila. Samila. You fight well. That woman you just defeated was no common witch. There are others like her, sinners, who stand against our kingdom. We must be very careful. Their ceremony is progressing swiftly. While you have done well in rescuing me, there is more to be done. First, we must head to the library. It's a safe spot. Where's that, your majesty? A bit further ahead, but not too far. I will know when we are nearby. Be wary of ambushes on your way there. I've seen corpses of nuns around. The witches haunt our presence. Understood. We'll be careful. <coughs> Why do I feel like this is the kind of game that's going to have the twist where uh, the princess is evil? The princess is with us now. Let's head to the library to keep her safe. Yeah, sure. Totally. She's totally not going to, you know, turn out to be the big bad. You know what? That's too obvious, right? Like, that's the kind of twist you would expect of, like... Uh, basic, basic bitch, right? In fact, I think that is, that is, that, that is in fact, uh, no, I'm not, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna say that because that's a spoiler. I, I, I thought better of that. <laughs> I'm not even gonna say what, what it's a spoiler for, just that it's a spoiler. Uh, yeah, that's, that's, that's basic writing. And I'm, I'm not gonna anticipate basic writing here. Oh, this is. How lovely! We fought through all of that for a locked door. Do enemies... Hold on, let's see. Enemies respawn. No. So it doesn't behave like a bonfire. That's interesting. I feel like that's what you would expect whether or not the game's a dark... Uh, like a Souls-like or not. At, at this point. I mean, that that is definitely directly inspired by Souls, but... I feel like you would expect that at this point, regardless, you know? I got archive number 15. Oh! A nun dressed in black. She aspires to become a historian and likes to sleep after lunch. Her mother, a woman branded a witch, was burned alive by the Inquisition. Samela was then forced into clerical work to atone for her family's sins. Interesting. Sister Samilla's assistant. She is a young acolyte, lacking experience in combat. For that reason, Fran specializes in rituals for stealing witches. The sacred office is known for burning entire villages to eradicate the presence of the witches. I don't like the sacred office very much. Fran's hometown, a small village to the east of Oremir, is among the ones wiped by the church. Uh, here's the princess. The eldest princess of the holy kingdom of Remesia. Her wish is to stop the ceremony being conducted by the witches and restore the order in her land. In the current year, a council was established through which the two princesses would rule the kingdom. Despite that, her younger sibling, Princess Poem, betrayed both the crown and the church and allied herself with the witches. In an attempt to escape from her sister, Princess Amelia ended up being cursed. Now, as the princess sobs silently, beautiful twigs and leaves spread from her hair. Was that? That's the witch we just killed. A witch born of the southern forest seed. Lizette wandered towards the city of Oremir in search of the one who started the ceremony. 
there, near St. Hildred's Cathedral, she met Devoir. Both became responsible for taking care of Princess Amelia. The mark on her forehead is, a des is an indication of the vestigial blackening of her skin, a phenomenon common to those who undergo the witch transformation. The skin first turns black before stabilizing itself as another color. Ha! That, mmm. Mmm. Remesia is a northern kingdom bordering the kingdom of Vernilia. The two kingdoms were founded on sites of as sites of faith and are home to church organizations. As such, they've been at war with the witches since the first witch ceremony, when witchcraft was labeled a sin. Orimir is the capital of the holy kingdom of Remesia. The city is named after the nation's symbol, a white snake able to cure any disease. That does that hmm. Over 500 years old, <coughs> uh, it was originally built as a settlement to shelter the soldiers who fought the witches of old. As for the current year, the city has become the central battlefield for the Fourth Witch War. Many of its many of its inhabitants, including the royalty and the military, have either fled or barricaded themselves in their homes, awaiting for miracles from the uh, okay olivide. <coughs> the city of Rain is the sanctuary where the White Chapel is located. The city lives up to its nickname and houses mostly pilgrims and travelers from regions plagued by drought. The constant storms all year long are very much disliked by the local nuns. And uh, where... Uh... No, Fran is from... Aramir. Oh no, she's from the east of Aramir. Okay. Mercy Cellar. That's a good name for a location, I'll give you that much. I'll give you that. I'll tell you that for free. I like that name. Uh, let's go this way. This feels more like progress. Probably won't meet with any locked doors. Ooh. These guys- oh, these guys aren't super threatening. Three wax! What is- wait, what is our weapon? Okay, it's, it's straight up a sword. That's good to know. Hey, you're dead. Why is there a little hoppy section here? Oh! Jesus. Oh, look at that guy. Okay, just being creepy. That lady's just being creepy. Sorry. I I apologize. Wait. Switch among incenses equipped to the action slot. Incenses. Uh, oh. I can have passive incenses. White incense. Uh, what was that? RT? Let's see how that... Whoa. Hey, wait. Oh! It's like a little fireball. How fancy. We also have a map that I just discovered. That is very good. What are the feathers? Uh... Save spots? I can only assume? Wait. We were standing still for a second. It looked like there was fire around us. Also, do we have like a little crown? We have like a little crown on our head. That's weird. Why do we got a little ghost crown? It's floating there. Whoa. There's some evil shit going on here. That's the wrong button. There are so many corpses around. Yeah. Good job noticing, lady. That's that was mean. I'm sorry. That was that was incredibly rude of me. I should be more sympathetic to the fact that you're understandably upset at the number of Oh! People who have been horrifically murdered! Okay. Uh, inspect note. Under the rule of this house, I must confess, for I have broken my vows of obedience and chastity. Hell yeah! Two nights ago, I was indecent and acted impulsively. I want to regret these actions, if only it hadn't felt so good. Forgive me, Reverend Mother. Hell yeah! You do it! Get that dick! Or that clit. Whichever you prefer. In fact, clit is preferable. But also, that dick belongs to a lady. You do it. Get that dick. Hi. Ow. ow. Owie. Could you guys be less rude? Just for like five seconds? Can you also get fucked? For like five seconds? Not like, not like the girl that got fucked. Or did fuck. But, like, die. Get fucked. You know what I mean? Whoa, what's that? 
What's happening? Hi, princess. The library is just ahead. Please follow me. She's totally evil, guys. Look at that. She got the pure white dress. She got the big titties. Evil. <laughs> What's happening? Are we gonna get a flashback? Or what? What's happening? What's going on? Oh, okay. Thankfully, we arrived safely. Sisters of the Order, this is the secret library, a shelter for the royalty in times of need. I'll be staying here for my own safety. The witches are unaware of this area. For now. Your Majesty, we were part of a group of nuns that was headed to the cathedral. A uh, blizzard caught us, and we were set up. Uh, we were set apart. Me, uh, nope. You will find no living nun in these premises save for the two of you. Uh, oh, that's terrible. The cathedral's halls have been stained with the blood of those who devoted themselves to God. We have been outmatched by the enemy. Darkness leaks from every corner. No. You must find my younger sister. Poem. My voice just cracked. <clears throat> And stop her. She is responsible for curing the witch. Uh, for she is responsible for the witch's ceremony and for putting a curse on me. Yeah, we just read that, Laura. Girls, come on, get it together. If she's if she's allowed to do as she wants, more innocent lives will be sacrificed. Her madness needs to end. Poems should be at the castle. Your Majesty, how may we get there? The main entrance is locked by a barrier, a type of protective witchcraft. I'm afraid you won't be able to do much against it, but. That woman from before, the one dressed in black, she is a traitor of the church, previously known as Sister Dwar- Oh. Find her. She must know something about the barrier. A traitor. But then, will she cooperate with us? You will make her talk. You nuns have your methods. We sure do. Your majesty. I won't yield to my sister and abandon our people. Find Sister Dwar, the traitor. Even her poisonous tongue might be of use to us. I don't- it's set up so simple, like, you know, it's like, oh my god, hell no. I ain't fucking with that. I ain't fucking with no tutorials. <laughs> Hi, who are you? Hello there, and welcome. My name is Harina. This library is a special place connected to many others. I am the one in charge of it. Are you heading to the castle? That area isn't safe anymore. There are witches all over. Since you are around, why not take a look at some of the stuff I've got for sale? Some of it might prove to be useful. You never know. Why? Uh, oh, it's silver coins. Yep. Unleashes a projectile that deals more damage if the user's HP is full. That's a passive. That's a really good one. Let's save. Let's save our our silver coins for that. Wait, hold on. Let's talk. Let's chat. Let's chit chat. I overheard your conversation with the princess. Considering your pilgrimage to the cathedral must have taken a few days, I assume you haven't heard the news. The heretics have sunk two vessels from the White Chapel. Not even the southern monasteries are safe anymore. Sunk? What does that mean? You look fine, though. I suppose their witchcraft poses little threat to you. I'm capable. That's good. Keep up with that. That better not have been a difficulty setting thing. Hi. Sister, if I... Uh, okay, you're, I'm not going to get much more out of you, am I? Yes. Let's return to the previous location. So that... That is... A f so this is effect this this whole thing is effectively a bonfire. With the light and the ink well. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Well, there's we ain't getting back up now. What's that? Can I That just gave me experience. That's all that did. Any circuits? Nope. Whoa! Okay, wait, that's all I came down here for is a little flower. Oh, okay. Hello. Oh, that's also the same sound. I like I like how reminiscent this is of uh, Momodora, because it, it has the exact same sound effects as as that one. Some of the same enemies too. I mean, obviously not you know like visually identical, but. This is a rough translation of a witch saying, according to the Reverend Mother's Edict, uh, number four, wait, no, oh, okay, whatever, is that like circa 4-1202? We bathe beneath the tears of the world, only hoping they welcome and accept us. That 
doesn't sound so bad. That that's a nice saying. They sound like a like a gentle bunch. I think I like them witches. It's kind of like how um I feel I feel like we're going to get a similar thing where it's like you actually read through the the like satanic statements of like of like Levian Satanism and you're like, "Huh. No, that makes sense. All of that makes perfect reasonable sense." <laughs> and and you and suddenly you're like, "Maybe maybe the church sucks." That's that's kind of the point I'm getting at. Whoa, that smog doesn't look great. Can I just merge? Oh! I'm gonna avoid this spell. Well, that smog silenced me. So I imagine that means I can't use any of my fancy incenses. These guys are very annoying. Also, this platforming. Don't don't feel super great. Feels a little bit clonk. It's not bad. It's I, 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 Momodora is, it feels a lot more, a lot more fluid, is, I think, my, my main issue here. This feels a lot, this feels a lot more, a lot more solid than Momodora does. Not, not solid in, in the, you know, slang vocabulary of being good. What is that? What is that? What are you? Can I attack you? Whoa, your enemies. Okay. <laughs> I mean, I expected that they were... Oh, I see them clearly now. I thought it was one thing, not two different little things. Archive number 16. Let's give that a read. I feel like the archives are going to give us like the real story. St. Hildreth's Cathedral. St. Hildreth's Foundation dates back to some centuries ago, when the cathedral was under St... St. Ime's direction. At the time, the threat of witches was less significant, and the nuns enjoyed a much more peaceful life. But currently, the site is no longer used for prayer, and it hosts the conflict against the witches who trespassed into it. The cathedral's close proximity to the royal castle has turned it into a strategic location. Huh. I don't like that. Separation of church and state and all that good shit, you know? Hey, let's go into the light. Yes, because we want to buy the passive incense. Hey, can I buy this from you? Thank you. No, thank you. I love you. You. Let's look at her a little bit, actually. She's got a cool design, too. I like her ponytail. Ponytail and good hair color. That's my fucking hair color right there. No wonder I like her. I'm projecting. <laughs> That's me in the video game. Oh, I... Have shit for brains. Walked right into a group of fucking enemies. Okay, well, you know, let's just let's just not. Let's not, let's not if we don't have to, right? Okay, so there there looked to be a path down when we were in this previous room, right? Yes. Hey, these guys are really cute. I like them. They look like little devils. They're real, they're real super cute. Whoa. That was a big fall. Cathedral key. Edo. Good. I'm glad I have that. <laughs> uh, whoa, wait. How fast can we attack? A lot faster than I thought. Cause I don't know, I don't know why. I feel, I feel like I've been staggering my, I was staggering my attacks a little bit. That is a real fast attack. Uh-oh. What's happening? Hello? Oh, hi. Whoa, you're a tough boy. What is happening? Oh. I'd see, I, I feel like these guys would be a good test to see if the, if the dodge roll has iframes. I should probably do that. Actually, no, it very clearly has iframes because we're able to go through enemies with it. Is that it? Are we good? Cool. Is that going to happen a lot? Are they just going to they, they throw like waves of enemies at us? Oh, that looks like it shoots poison or something. I don't like these. Really? Oh, because I guess I was standing in, in another cloud fire. Yeah! Wait. It feels like I've 
been here already. I have been. This is that one we couldn't open before. Wow, I'm very silenced. Okay, so if this game gives me a chance to side with the witches, oh, well, by golly, that's what I'm gonna do. Because the witches seem pretty cool. They seem pretty chill. And you know what? If they're okay with that with that diary person fucking, if they're cool with with that, uh, I think I'll like them. Cause, that, Cause you know what's great? Fucking, fucking's great. Can I open this? Locked. Oh. Well, shoot. Where do we go now? We got a key, and we don't know. Uh, oh well. No, wait, hold on. There was like a whole. Like on the right, there's a whole like tower there with two different paths to go. So let's go this way. Right. And then we will. Hello. Hello, friend. You guys are very rude. I don't like you very much. Oh, the bomb can also do damage to them. That's good to know. I don't think I will ever properly take advantage of that, but that's good to know. I also wanted to double check that there wasn't. Uh, a secret there. That looked like a... Oh, wait. No, they, they, these guys, those ones just died in one hit. So we're level, like, 10 already? Is there anything we can do with, like, levels? This, this not, it's not that dark. It's not that Dark Souls. Wait. Oh, right. We went up an elevator. Oh. And we can go this way. Oh, so... No, the game wanted us to go in, a, like, a little... In a loop. Like, down and then back up. I see. I understand. I understand what the video game wanted. This is a very nice looking zone, though. Uh, gotta say. The visual style of this game is very good. It, it, it took... It took a second. Because I'm used to, um... Momodora, you know? That doesn't look right. Is that some bloodstained shit? I suspect that to be some bloodstained shit, and we'll come back later and kill that moon. Um, but, okay, so, I guess, like, something, I, I'm, I'm a little bit disappointed in myself that I was a little bit off-put by the visual style. Considering I've been, I've been kind of ragging on the Momodora community for a while now, because they freaked the fuck out when, um, it, it was, like, announced... That the Momodora after um, Reverie Under the Moonlight would be uh, like a like a 3D successor to the series. They freaked the fuck out because the games have always been, you know, a uh, 2D pixel art kind of thing. And I, and and so me me kind of taking a second to get used to to the visual style seen here. A little bit disappointed in myself because because I'm just kind of that's kind of doing the exact thing that people were, you know. Unwarrantedly losing their fucking shit about. Uh, I can't jump that high. Oh, I can. Oh, hello. I'm level 10 now. I'm big and strong. Uh oh. I totally thought that one was gonna hit me. I attack way faster than than I think. I need I need to keep that in mind. I attack big fast. Oh, we have to go back up, I guess. Whoop. Yep. Hey. Eat shit, my dude. This... Yeah, that's... I think that was a secret wall there, though. Because that didn't quite... That didn't quite, um... Connect. Look at that. Yep. I am big and smart. Whoa. Dude, this place looks fucking sick. Woo! Wow. They just came out of corpses. Whoa! And they did a big damage to me. Oh no, they're, oh no, they're just coming out of nothing. What are these little guys? Ow! Wow! Dude, that fucking hurt! You do big hits! I don't want to eat any more of those hits. Archive. Uh, let's read that. Sacred Office. The formal organization of the church. Its main building, the White Chapel, is located at the city of Olivide. 
The Sacred Office is a powerful entity, highly respected and feared by society. It is led by His Eminent Grace, the authority who directly communicates with the gods. Apart from him, the organization is commanded by several orders of nuns. Among them is the Order of the Twelfth Saint, which stands out as the largest and most influential one. These orders dictate the laws of the gods to the common folk, and promise great rewards in life for those who follow and obey. At the same time, the citizens who defy the church's sayings are met with persecution and judged as heretics. These trials, ran by the church's inquisitorial branch, are oppressive acts that decide the fate of the individuals under investigation. Most of the time, the defendant is found guilty and sentenced to be burned alive. Okay, so it's uh, quite similar to a uh, to a real-life church. Not gonna say which one. But I'm not gonna say that it's not the Catholic one. That's that's how that's how we're gonna roll, all right? I'm not big I'm not big on 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 those folks. Let's just say that. I'm not super super down to chill with uh with the church. Let's say. Let's say that. Let's say all those things. I'm sure there. I'm sure. Hey, uh, it's not fair. That's not entirely fair. I'm sure if you are a faithful or religious person, you're pro. You're probably fine. Uh, it's just you know, the folks in power. What did I just get? You've gained the charged attack ability. Hold down the melee attack button to unleash a special attack. Whoa, and that is, and we can, we can hold it. We can sure as fuck hold it. Can I open that? Locked. Well, oh, there's a, I have a limited number of them. How do I... Video games. Locked. Those all, those all require, like, a specific key. Like, it shows you a picture of the key. I, I, I respect that, at least. That's, that's a good little inclusion. Like, including a visual of the key that you need. Hey, could you not? Also... I would love a little bit of a, a little bit of a top off, you know. So we're just gonna go. Oh, oh wow, that's a lot. It's actually a lot further than I remembered it being. Oh no, I wanted to go up. I wanted to go up though. I'm almost, I'm almost gonna test for secret walls while I'm stuck here. Uh... Because it's set up. I, I, I didn't realize that the up was activate elevator and not choose direction of elevator to go. Because I'm... I'm so smart, guys. I'm big and smart and strong. Uh... Okay. Well. That was an easy path. Hey, folks. Could you fall? Very cool of you. Can you guys climb ladders? No. So I don't really gotta worry about that at least. That's that's good to not have to worry about. Hey, let's do that. Thanks. Now. I don't want to end the video until we make some solid progress in some direction. So, I mean, this looks like the only way that we can go that... Uh, hasn't really borne fruit, aside from... What even hit me there? Aside from the key that we got. So let's go through. Like... There's an entrance down at the bottom. Alright, we could go check that out. Hello, boys. Y'all cute. I want a little plush of these guys. They're super adorable. If the Momodora, if the Momodora folks ever decide to make merch, I'm I'm buying one of the one of those little guys. Uh, all right, so we go this way. It looks like it's gonna take us to an area that we've totally been to before, like a, like at a higher elevation, you know? Because that that room with the with the feather that we're heading towards is the one that I was looking at before and trying to figure out what the fuck the feather is. Oh, it, it's it's an ink well because you you use a a quill. It's not a feather. It's a quill. 
I have brains. I know what I'm talking about when I talk about things. Yeah, there we go. I'm big and smart. Let's go over here. Because there was definitely... Whoa! You guys, sh you shouldn't be here. You are very tough. There, there, there are these boys of varying, varying levels, I will say. The ones that seem to pop in have a lot more health than you might expect. I also can't tell if that's a two combo or a three combo. I should maybe give it a second and, and watch it, but I don't got the fucking patience for that. My guys, my dudes, I'm st I'm dumb as rocks. Don't expect me to be patient. Ooh, healing and sense obtained. That we have that. That's uh, that's a thing that we have. Oh, but I get six of them now. Nifty. Hey, could you not do that? Hey, buddy. Oh. That was a parry. Parries are cool. I should do parries more. That was fucking badass. That was the coolest fucking thing ever. I got a silver coin. Holy shit. I... That surprised the fuck out of me. I was like, what? What? What's happened? Did I die? No, I just did some cool fucking shit. Wait. Okay, I can't... I cannot... So, important to note, one cannot parry or roll in the sky, or like while you're while you're jumping. That's a fuck. That's a fucking cool parry. This video game is awesome. That's some cool shit. This video game is some cool shit, guys. Whoop. Ow. Okay, that one. That one hurt. That's something that I'm gonna need to practice. Rome wasn't built in the day and all that. I can't just start going hog wild on these. Ow! Hey, what's this? A silver coin. That's... Not, not a secret wall. Look at that! That's some ob- that was some obvious secret wall bullshit. I imagine I can probably get up there. And then, you know. It will be revealed that it was a secret wall all along, and you had no idea, but I knew. I knew, because I'm smart. Hi, Bounce. Uh... Hello. Can I? That, yeah, that one's not locked with a key. Yeah, look, we can go... There's, like, area... Down below where we were before. Which is weird because I don't think I even visually saw that. I mean, I want to at least fight another boss before we end the video, but this is going to be a super long video. This is going to be. It's going to be a big one. You guys, you guys strap in. Because we're going to. We're going to do our best to see some stuff. So we can't just do one. Fucking boss, like that's not cool. That's not a very exciting video. Oh, we can't go back. It appears that we are not in a position to go back to the beginning of the video game. So that leads me to believe. Wait. That's strange. That's strange, right? That's a completely sealed off area. There's gotta be a secret wall that I missed. Hello? Secret. Secret. Secret? Where? How do I get into that? I, I'm beyond it now. What the heck? Other side? Let's go. Hold on. Hold on. We have to do... We have to do a... An exploration here. Because look. Like, below it. 
Or maybe maybe going above. That's probably it. Going going from above is is the. Oh hi. I didn't expect to see you. Yeah, that's the thing. Did we were we able to go into the next? I can't remember anything. My my short term memory is no, we weren't. Okay, wait. No, that was locked. Yeah, with the with the other key that we don't have. Right. Okay. My brain has compartmentalized all of the information, and I am now big and smart. Uh... Okay, yeah, I... If nothing else, I don't understand the timing of their attacks. Because they're... mildly unpredictable. Which is not to say, you know, you can't tell when they're going to attack, but it is to say it's very difficult to tell because they're... Highly delayed. And I'm just gonna I'm just gonna I'm just gonna do the smart thing and just kill them. Without without getting fancy. Cause you can you can just easily do like dodges and shit, you know? I don't gotta get fancy. Was I able to go down to the to the to the cellar? No, that was locked with a different key. Okay, there are a few other routes that we could go. First and foremost, that little that little square of room. Hey, ow! I totally forgot how to change my. That's not the one that I was expecting. I was expecting my little fireball. Oh yeah! Oh yeah. Ow! Fuck off, guy. Okay, you can you can cycle from left to right with. Okay. Uh, so we go, go take a big down. Wait, no, we couldn't go this way either. Whoa! Well, that's, that was a lot more juice than I was expecting. Yeah, this also is not a direction for us to go. We had the secret there. We had the locked. And then. Did we can't. So, video games. Where do you expect for me to go? I don't know if I fully understand what you want. There's a path here that we could maybe go. Did we? Did I not go up the elevator? Oh, I probably should have killed that guy. This is gonna be a very annoying elevator ride. Or not. Okay. Why do they not go up the elevator? What? Uh, I am big and smart. And strong. And tough. There's a bed here. Doesn't look like a very comfortable bed. Oh. Oh boy. Big, not a fake wall. Okay, look at that. These are these are normally normally reasonably difficult enemies that I'm currently fighting. Not enemies that fuck my shit up with one attack. Oh, there's a dead lady there. I place that I will be able to get to when I unlock the ability to become a cat because the icon of this game on Steam is the silhouette of a cat. And that then that's that's something that started with actually I don't I shouldn't say that. But that's something that happens in Reverie Under the Moonlight. You can transform into a cat. And the the icon for that one is... That looks like a boss. Hey, folks! I think we got what I wanted. Just, that's a... You know, just a guess. Uh... I'll do, maybe do a heal. This boy seems vaguely... Vaguely... Vaguely tough? Oh! You can't go. You can't go through him. You can go over him, though. Maybe. I don't have a. I don't have a second jump. So. Nope. You can go through him. Okay. This is a. A a fight so so laid back. He does not even have a name. It's not. It's not. It doesn't bode well for you, 
in terms of your importance, my, my, my friend. Wait, I can just... Yeah. Wow, the... Okay, so, the Christ... The, the Christ and... Incense? Very good. Very good incense. I like that incense. You, you can just call down lightning upon some poor, unsuspecting bloke and blow him the fuck up! A boss, uh... Feels like it was substantially easier than Liz. But... I think we're done. I mean, that's all the video game that you guys are gonna be allowed to see. Until you play it for yourselves, because... Seriously... Support... Indie devs. Th supporting indie devs is more important than supporting any dev. Um, so this game is available on Steam. I don't know if it's actually... Hold on. Let me, let me see if it's available... On... The platform that is superior to Steam. Itch.io. It is not available on Itch.io. So... Can you buy it directly from their site? It doesn't seem like it. Well, that sucks. Because I, I would always vastly prefer, you know... Oh, but it's also coming to Switch. So if you have a Switch and you want to play this game... I don't know if it's out on Switch at the same time as it's being released on Steam. That's not something that I know. But once it's available on Switch, you could also you could play it on Switch. Anyway, uh, this has been Midor Minoria. I, I I hope you liked the video. This video was very. Um, I feel like this was my best. <laughs> That's funny. This I feel like this is my best um, one-off video where I'm not super. I feel like I'm actually making points and talking about the video game properly. So that's cool. Um, if you liked the video, you can subscribe. Maybe maybe drop a like. Drop a comment if you want to suggest another game that I should maybe possibly take a look at. If it's similar to this or if you just think it's a neato game. Uh, I love you all. Oh, there, hold on. Before I, before I finish, there's going to be a link to buy this down in, in the description. So do it. I will also put one for Momodora Reverie Under the Moonlight because that's a very good video game. You should also buy that. Anyway, I love you all. I hope you all have a wonderful morning, afternoon, or evening. And as always, I am no longer here.